All right, so good morning. <laughs> good morning, good morning, good morning. New every morning is thy love awaking and uprising prove. Through sleep and darkness, safely brought, restored to life and power and the thought. New mercies each returning day hover round us while we pray. New perils past, new sins forgiven, new thoughts of God, new hopes of heaven. Just touching bases, people, just reminding us that Today is a brand new day, which we have been granted another opportunity to wake up and give thanks and continue to move. Remember that it's the movement that will help our bodies to continue to become stronger. Changing the diet, leave some stuff out, especially the dairy, especially the dairy. I found out recently that dairy, I was wondering <laughs> what happened why sometimes I cannot hold my notes and realized that for so long I have not messed with cheese and stuff like that. And all of a sudden, my husband bought a tin of New Zealand cheese and I really love cheese, And but if it's not there, I don't miss it. And I'm enjoying it and I, and I go back and I said, okay, milk, dairy is not good for the voice box, right? <laughs> Dairy, we know that it produces a lot of mucus, and so it fills our um, nasal or um, sections with 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 the mucus, which prevents and creates a lot of chaos. So the less dairy we use, guys, the better off we'll be. We can get our calcium from other sources, but if you find that when you drink milk or eat cheese or eat eggs, or and I was eating two eggs each day, just a white. I would squeeze the yolk out and I would eat the white, but I have decided that I don't need those right now. And so I'm not doing that anymore. Since school start, I haven't had one egg. Actually cut it off in the couple last weeks of the December. But I'm here and I'm thankful and I'm always thankful and the cheeks, getting the extra cheeks, but you know what? <laughs> There's just more smiles to give, right? <laughs> but, um, yeah, you can work on it by you kiss up and, and strengthen that, I heard. So as you lose the weight and you start finding the looseness, you have to work on that part. You just kiss up, kiss, and hold it so you notice that. When you do that, you don't see the double chin right there. But apart from that, we're thankful, right? If we're here kissing up and trying to tone up stuff, then it means that it's working. It means that you're losing some inches. It means a lot. So just do what you have to do, but do it with a sound mind and eat right. Do the best you can do with your fruits and your vegetables, your raw fruit, your raw vegetables if you can. You know, chew, eat up some raw carrots, um, eat up your lettuce, eat up your tomatoes. They say tomatoes are bad for arthritis, but tell me what is not bad for something. Everything we pick up to put into our mouths, they tell you, oh, it's not good, it's not good. So just stay in moderation and 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 keep your minds at, at peace. Don't get caught up into stuff. And because otherwise we weren't gonna eat a darn thing <laughs> because everything is bad for something, you know, but moderation is good. And um, I wanted to let you know that I did create a GoFundMe page, and I want to give a shout out to my sister. Um, AG was the first one to bless the page, the, the GoFundMe. And we have another person who gave $40. So right now in our GoFundMe, there's 60 bucks. I did post a link on the community page. I will post it in this video. And I also sent it on WhatsApp. I didn't get any responses from WhatsApp except for AG. Thank you again, AG, for your undying support from day one. I so totally appreciate you. You became a member. 
you have been just totally, totally, totally supportive. And for that, I say thank you. Um, so, guys, if you can, I mean, it's going to take about 150 each week to get to keep things going. For this week, we have enough food. I did buy the cylinder of gas already. Um, for next week, it won't take so much, probably about 100 Maybe a hundred and twenty because we have to. I will not. I will be giving the gas money for the guy to to give them the ride to deliver the stuff. So because we have gotten all the containers out the way, and we have gotten the cylinder of gas. So next week my budget won't be um, as much as this week. Um, so my but oh wait, I sent two hundred last week, two fifty. Okay, so this coming week I won't be sending that much because some of the things are out of the way. So I probably just send 150 to just get the food items again to, to start cooking again um, for them for next week. So again, people, thanks for all your support. Thanks for all of you well-wishers. And again, if you can support with contributing to the GoFundMe, and we're not doing a car, we're just going to pay somebody, give them the gas money and go forward. As one commenter, thank you so much, YC, who mentioned that if you buy a car, it's going to eat up all with my little budget. So far, I'm not, you know, I am doing this, you know, so I'm trying to get funding to just keep it going. Um, even though it will continue even on my budget alone, but um, I'm reaching out for anybody who has the means to support, to just give us some support, okay? So no cars, we're not purchasing a car. Um, as I read the comment from the person, you think of registering it, insuring it, it drops in those potholes and have, needs a new tire, needs this, needs, it has to be maintained. So we'll just do... The person who will take gas money to help the, to, to get the food, the two miles plus, to get it out there. We are grateful for that. So my people, thank you for all of everything. Your love, your encouragement, your positive words, your prayers, your, your appreciation, your whatever you contribute. Your memberships. Um, Red, Jet, I haven't seen you in a minute. I pray and hope that you are okay, Jet. Um... I'm just going to lift you up in prayer, so take care of yourself and all of you, my viewers and my subscribers, wherever you are today, know that God will pour out an extra portion of blessing on each and every one of you. Um, sometimes the blessings we are looking for is not what we get, but just know that you're consistently blessed. Every prayer that goes up for you is a blessing, and so let us always be thankful so that at no point we'll seem ungrateful. Can't be good, be careful what good do good. I'm in doing my work, the work that I love to do. I do enjoy my job as a teacher. There's some things that are being rattling. <laughs> like, you know, you're hearing about a kid shooting a teacher, six, a six year old child bringing a gun to school and shooting a teacher. It, it can be heart rending, it can become a mental problem, but I trust God and I pray and I hope that as we walk in each day, that he'll walk with us into these trying times of children and, and, and the hearts of men who has grown so wicked. So pray for us, lift us up. Don't forget your teachers near and far. Please just remember us in prayer as we continue onward and upward always.